Hey guys, this is Scott from Forgot to Roll Podcast. Welcome to another edition of Gin Scott Headed, our weekly rant series where I rant about a different movie, TV, entertainment, or pop culture related really topic. Today I'm going to be ranting about why I like product placements in movies, or why I approve of them, I should say. I don't always like them, but I generally approve of the practice of putting product placements. So that's what I'm going to be ranting about today, and yeah, let's just get started. I, why do I approve of product placements in movies, guys? And that's because I know why products are placed in movies. Most people just think it's just for that product to try and be sold. And that's, yeah, that's why the company, you know, why Pepsi tries to get, and Coke get, try to get their cans in every big blockbuster. But the reason why the movies do it is they get paid for it. They, they make some money. And so I get that. I work in marketing, so I understand that these big studios spend a lot of money on movies. And if they can recoup some of that cost by putting a freaking product in a movie well why not why not put that new freaking austin martin or the new mercedes let every car be a chevy whatever it is why not do it to help kind of meet like mitigate the costs of built million dollar movies like some of these movies get way up there like justice league was a couple hundred million dollar movie of course they had to stick a couple product placements in there to kind of mitigate the thing especially since it didn't do as well at the box office as everybody thought and hoped because that's never a sure thing but you know what is a sure thing a check from coke just because you put a can of coke in a movie so like i'm okay with it i don't mind it but yeah sometimes i agree guys sometimes i don't like it which means when they're lazy about it because that's that's not the product's fault as much that's usually the writing's fault that's that's the writers or the director being too lazy with the product. And the way you can kind of tell this is if you look at my favorite example of product placement in any movie, and that's Wayne's World, and the way they promote the different products in that, which is always kind of, the, they make a joke about it. They're saying, no, we don't do that, and then they do it. And it's a funny thing, I really enjoy it, and that's because they took the time to write it into the movie as opposed to just inserting a product and being like, yeah, there's a Coke, there's a, you know, brand of, Asian milk of some kind. That's Transformers. That happened in Transformers. You can look it up. Maybe I'll put a picture up if I remember to look it up. I probably won't, but you can look it up. That happens. So yeah, I agree. It's not always great. Sometimes it's too lazily done, but I think in general that it's still a good thing that movies have the opportunity to be able to do product placement and be able to recruit some of the costs that are associated with making these movies. Because if they weren't we'd probably get less and less movies because it's an expensive endeavor, especially as we move forward. Like certain technologies like CGI is both gonna be more cheaper but more expensive. It's a whole, it's this weird thing because technology keeps improving so we try to move forward. It's a whole thing so if they can just, you know, like I said, they can reduce their cost, reduce their risk of how much money they're gonna lose on a movie just by putting a couple cans of Coke or, you know, making sure they're driving the newest Jag or something. I'm cool with that, and I got no problem with that. I'm, like I said, I'm in marketing, so I'm cool, like, you know, I'd love to be the dude one day who gets to, you know, go on to a movie set and try and convince them to be like, yo, you you want this product in there, here's some, some, some money, you know, let's do it. So, you know, I really approve of this thing in general, so that's my thoughts, guys, about product placement in movies. Let me know, guys, what you think. Do you approve of it? Do you hate it? What are some good examples you've noticed in movies? What are some bad examples you've noticed in movies? Let me know in the comments below. Thanks for joining me again for another rant today. Have a good one.